<laughs> hey there, TikTokers. We bet many of you have watched the popular cartoon show My Little Pony Friendship is Magic and have seen how joyful and playful its protagonists from the land of Equestria are. Today, we'll be talking about them. And no, you're not wrong. This is a scary Tuesday. Today, we'll be sharing with you an urban legend about the somber origin of these charming characters. A few years ago, a user from the United States wrote in a creepypasta forum about the discovery of an event from many years ago, which had a strange connection to the show. The user talked about six girls who all went to the same school in North Carolina and who all died on the same day. January 18th, 1989. Their particular circumstances and their personalities had a striking resemblance to the main characters in My Little Pony. It's as if the show's creators had taken inspiration from them. The first girl, Samantha Gales, was very similar to Fluttershy. She was very shy and introverted. So much so that she never told anyone about the living hell she had to endure at home. Her mother had her when she was very young and would always blame Samantha for ruining her life. Her stepfather didn't pay any attention to her either and whenever he had to deal with Samantha, he would lock her up in the basement, sometimes for an entire day. The situation got worse when Samantha's stepsister was born, and she was completely neglected from then on. She was barely fed, her room was taken away, and she had to sleep in a corner of the house. Her only consolation were the animals she would rescue from the streets, which she would lovingly take care of. Unfortunately, even then, her desperation became so extreme that she decided it wasn't worth living anymore. The second girl, Janice Walters, was always one of the most popular girls at school. She was rich, intelligent, beautiful. It's like she was living a dream life. However, her parents were very selfish and hated each other. They would argue all the time, although they always tried to look like a happy family when in public. Unfortunately, the truth is that Janice's mother only married for money and her father was sinking in a ton of debt. To be able to keep up her image, Janice got very interested in fashion and even started making her own dresses. She dreamed of becoming a fashion designer and living in Paris, but her parents wouldn't allow it. They demanded her to stay and marry a rich man. Then one day, while the three of them were in the car, they started arguing, and the car crashed, killing Janice instantly. She was the inspiration for Rarity. Alexandra Matthews was a competitive young girl, especially in sports. Her father always wished to have a boy, and thus raised Alexandra like one and pressured her to always be the best. Her achievements made her very popular, and many talent scouts from different universities were after her. This pushed her to train even harder, and her dream was to one day participate in the Olympic Games. However, when her father finally had the son he always wanted, he stopped paying so much attention to Alexandra. She then tried to gain back her father's affection by working harder. She dedicated hours and hours running on the track, neglecting her friendships and studies, and even her health. She never knew she suffered from a delicate heart condition, which resulted in her collapsing after so much training and passing away a few days later. She was the inspiration for Rainbow Dash. The most similar girl to Applejack was Jamie Sanders, who was part of a family of farmers. On one hand, her farm was going through a rough patch and they were really struggling to stay afloat. On the other hand, Jamie was the second one of many siblings and so she needed to work very hard in addition to taking care of her younger siblings. She never had time for her friends and would dedicate her nights to studying. 
Her parents were way too proud to accept handouts and were very hardworking too. So much so that they ended up passing away due to physical ailments. Jamie and her siblings were then left under the care of her elderly grandma, but the girl still did what she could to keep the family afloat by working as a gardener. And that's how one fateful day, Jamie had a horrible accident. She died by falling into a wood chipper. The inspiration for Pinkie Pie is even more depressing. Katherine Jackson was an orphan. She was just five years old when her father killed her mother and then killed himself. After that, Katherine constantly jumped from home to home. And the families that adopted her would always be more interested in any financial help they would receive instead of caring about feeding and dressing Catherine. Moreover, the horrible memories of her parents' deaths still haunted her, chipping away at her sanity. She would have constant nightmares where her mother would be screaming or her father would be threatening Catherine about killing her one day. Then later on, when she started high school, Catherine started suffering from hallucinations and started behaving very strangely. Her classmates thought that maybe she was just hyperactive and she would also spend time drawing fantasy objects. Then one day, a voice inside her head told her that she could fly and then decided to jump from a building. And lastly, we have Cynthia Little, who was the inspiration for Twilight Sparkle. Since she was little, Cynthia was always a great student and was put in more advanced classes. And while she was successful academically, her little brother was successful in sports and athletics. Cynthia's parents would boast about how proud they felt about having not only one genius in the family, but two. And soon enough, a special academy for gifted children started becoming interested in her. Cynthia knew that was a huge opportunity. However, there were only a few spots available and she would need to pass a very tough exam. She started getting desperate and started studying so much that she neglected eating and sleeping. When the exam day drew near, she panicked and decided to cheat. However, she was caught, her parents were horrified and Cynthia sunk into a deep depression. Soon after, she took her own life out of sheer shame. And now, think about the main characters of the show. Fluttershy takes care of the animals she loves. Rarity is a successful designer with loving parents. Rainbow Dash is a great athlete. Applejack has a successful apple farm. Pinkie Pie is a happy and carefree party planner. And Twilight Sparkle was accepted in a prestigious magic school before moving to Ponyville. It's kind of like the creators of the show wanted to give to the tormented spirits of those poor girls all the things they wanted but couldn't get in life. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it. And if you want to see more Draw My Life videos, subscribe to our channel. See you in the next episode!